Wow, guys, the craziest thing just happened. Uh, the Ta'al volcano uh, near Taigatai, where actually Chris and I got married uh, just over three years ago, just erupted. And um, there's ash falling right on the streets everywhere. So I just had to go to the store really quick. And uh, my hair right now is covered by ash. And uh, when I came home, this is what I found out is happening. Yeah, that's crazy. This right there is ash from the volcano. The Al volcano is actually about 80 kilometers away from here. And yeah, this is the ash that it just spat out. And you know, even though I was wearing a mask while I was outside, uh, I felt ash just coming down my face so much that I even I had some go right in my eyes uh, on a couple of occasions. So I actually I just looked in the mirror and it turns out that my eyes are a little bit reddish. I mean, I guess it must have been some kind of ir irritation from the ash. Uh, but <laughs> uh, yeah, according to Google, last time that there was a major eruption uh, at the Al at the Ta Al volcano was back in 1977, uh, and right now it's only just uh, having some smoke come out. But I don't know yet how uh, heavy of a, of an eruption is possibly even coming after this. So hopefully it's not going to be too major. But there's been a level three alert uh, issued on the volcano so far and uh people have been evacuated uh, from around the area but just let's just hope and pray that it's not going to be anything too serious the surrounding area of the volcano there are a lot of places that get hit actually much worse than just with simple uh dust and sand like this uh my parents house and got hit by different pieces of gravel now uh, luckily it doesn't seem like there was any damage done uh, that was seen yet but uh it might be only the beginning of uh, who knows what what's going to come out of the volcano. <laughs> she made the ash look like uh, the map of Africa. Mm -hmm. I guess you weren't going for that though, were you? It's gotten so bad that actually I just realized that uh, the ash that got on my face was actually starting to burn my eyes even a little bit. So. I realized that uh, I should have just washed my face er earlier from all of this, but... The next wow. day... Hey, so I uh, wanted to just give a quick update on what's going on with the Tao Volcano. Right now the warning level has been raised from 3 to 4, uh, which actually means that uh, there's uh, an eruption imminent. Like uh, the real eruption, not just the smoke that's been coming out so far. Ash is still coming down. You can see here. There's a lot, there's a lot of ash uh, on the ground over here and uh, our balcony is covered with more ash. Yeah, that's how it looks like now. <laughs> so, uh, people are wearing masks, mostly. Mm -hmm. uh, although I did see some kids playing in a park, which uh, I don't think is very advisable. But uh, the, the air still smells like smoke, smells like ash. Not as bad as last night though. But uh, it's definitely not a good idea to be outside without a mask. So the majority of people are, that are outside right now, they're all wearing masks. Uh, we're just kind of uh, sitting and praying uh, that the eruption is not going to be too violent. But the uh, authorities are saying that there will be an imminent eruption at the Al volcano uh, with magma, lava, uh, you know, more ash and more smoke coming out. And um, we we'll just have to wait to see how it goes. Here in Metro Manila is actually not all that bad uh, compared to how it is closer to the volcano, as you can imagine. Uh, because uh, in the city of Taigatai, uh, where my in-laws have, uh, have a house over there, uh, they have some very serious uh, fallout from the ash and the little particles, some of which are not so little, uh, because they have uh, pebbles uh, about this big in some cases, uh, like uh, the ash clouds. Uh, some of which are several centimeters or a couple of inches in diameter. So that's kind of like a pretty big hailstorm of uh, debris coming from the volcano. Uh, that actually might have caused some damage over there. We're not going to know until later uh, when we're going to go visit uh, the house over there where we had our wedding reception uh, three years ago. the right to the volcano. <laughs> Steam coming out of this hole over here. 
the side of a volcano. Chris and our fearless guide. <laughs> Grass and the ground is very warm to the touch. Yeah. And there's this piece of stone it's called. Wet steam. how the whole area is going to be affected over there and you know the skies are just looking really hazy right now uh, it's not always very sunny around this time but still there's like a heaviness in the air that you can just kind of see some people are not wearing masks but most people are which is definitely advisable right now because the air is very heavy and uh, you don't want to be breathing that in unnecessarily I've never experienced uh, anything to uh, a volcano eruption before this is uh, really a unique thing for me right here in BGC uh, the cleanup crews are clearing out the ash from the from the pavement uh, because they're hoping that there's not going to be any more fallout a lot of people are not coming into work today because they've been advised not to go outside since uh, there's still uh, really heavy air uh, coming down and uh, there's a lot of ash clouds. So uh, some people are choosing not to go to work and uh, I know that the government offices are closed today uh, due to the danger of the air. So, uh, so far it kind of seems like it's mostly business as usual though, except for the extra cleanup crews that are coming around and uh, a lot of people wearing masks. Hopefully people are going to be protecting themselves because uh, inhaling ash and smoke is definitely not good for anybody. But so, for, so far from what I've been reading, it looks like there's uh, going to be an imminent uh, major eruption that might be happening from the Ta'al volcano. We'll just have to uh, wait and see how that goes. And uh, as uh, time progresses, I'm going to keep you updated guys uh, to let you know what's going on. <laughs> 